learners today we are going to start with uh, different types of k map uh, different types of k maps may we are having two variable k map three variable k map and four variable k map so one by one i am going to show you how to create these types of maps so we will be starting with two variable k map and in two variable k map i will be creating a map over here and uh, make you understand how the map is being uh, uh, has been created so uh, let me create a box over here since i'm talking about two variable k map so two variable k map i will be having two variables so the variable names will be given over here so if i say the first variable name is a and second variable name is b then you can see over here a and b are the variable names and it will be divided into uh, 2 raised to power n is the formula and 2 raised to power 2 will give me 4 so it will be I'll be getting four combinations over here. I mean, similar four uh, partitions. So, like this. So here will be A will be zero. Then here B will be zero. If A and B are zero, then out output will be zero. If A is zero and B is one, okay, then output will be one. Then if A is one and B is zero, B is zero over here. So output will be you can see two over here and if a is 1 and b is 1 the output will be 3 like this so if i'm talking about like if i'm talking about a and b if i talk about a and if i talk about b so if the value of a is 0 and b is 0 then output will be this output will be this if i talk about a 0 b 0 then output will be this and if i talk about a equal to 0 b equal to 1 then means i'm talking about this if i talk about a equal to 1 and b equal to 0 it means that i'm talking about this and if i talk about a1 and b1 it means that i'm talking about this cell so this is a representation of uh, two variables in a k map so let's move further and and check out how this is going to work in terms of Two variable k map so this is a simple representation so here you will be having a variable name the variable name aapke jo bhi hai, wo pe aayenge. variables hai, likhe de raun. okay these are the variable names over here so a and b are two variables so a has been looked like this yahan se yahan tak a hai. or if i move from left to right then it is b over here like this okay so let's let's solve this example with uh, two variable k map so your function is given and two variables a and b are given with the value 0 and 2. So uh, before moving further, let's uh, convert this into a k-map format. And this suppose this is the structure of a k-map. So here I will be writing my variable name. So a is my first variable and b is my second variable. So here the variable names will be there. So let me write down clearly. a is the name of the first variable and b is the name of second variable so these two variables are over here and i have to mark these two values so 0 and 0 uh, will give me 0 okay over here and 0 and 1 will give me 1 and 1 and 0 will give me 2 and 1 and 1 will give me 3 so according to this uh, numbering according to this values we have to fill the values which have been given over here so let me again draw this k map to make you understand how these values are being inserted in a k map so here is the k map representation for this question and a and b are my two values so as i just told you that a and b are the two variables which are being given over here so first value of a is 0 and b value is 0 and a value 1 and b value 1 so according to this according to this k map representation i'll be representing these values in this k map so first value, so let's mark these values given in a question so the first value is given which is zero you can see over here the value is zero first value is zero and second value is two so zero will come over here and i'll put one over here and two will come over here so i'll put one over here then i will combine these two these two and check over here that the variable value is changing or not so here you can see the value of a is changing from 0 to 1 so obviously a will be ignored but the value of b is 0 and throughout 
this the just see over here direction wise the value of v is zero so you have to check according to the group that you have taking the pair of so it's zero so b is zero so b zero will be marked as b dash and the value of function will be f equal to b dash or you can write like this f a comma b is equal to b dash so b dash is the minimized form of this two variables game app question